Oh, hello. Hi. Hello. <laughs> so, we are back at Chipotle. Cool. I got extra stuff this time. I got corn and like a little bit of salsa. Yeah, she's trying to copy me now. I asked you guys to ask me a bunch of questions on YouTube. Basically, a last kind of Q&A with Jason and I before the baby's born. I'm probably going to do a pregnancy Q&A because I haven't done one the whole time I've been pregnant. But this is just me and Jason's last Q&A together before the baby's born. Answering you guys' last minute questions. That's what I said for you guys to ask. Hope I don't look terrifying. I didn't get ready today, so don't. I don't think anybody's gonna get scared of me. They might. Will Jason be taking time off of work to help with the baby? What do you mean, taking off time from work? <laughs> so, you can tell them about your work. I work with work. Explain what that means. No. Jason and me do the same thing we work together. I think I've told you guys this, I'm not exactly sure if I have or not. But, like, right before we moved, basically, he worked at, like, a real job. I guess is what you say. Sorry. Like he went into a job and then yeah, basically what he was making in like a week I could make in like a day He was like I said to him basically I was like it'd be way more convenient if you just stayed home and helped me instead of going to work Because he'd go to work at night time But it was like mid after it was like late afternoon I guess because it was like four yeah, until, until like night So I was just like by myself with Laura doing whatever and I was like she's more cranky at night time because she wouldn't nap and whatever so i was like just quit your job and you can work and we could do the same thing together and that's where we are now these tortillas are weird no they're good i don't like who they say yes do you think they would look more alike i think Bert. i think me too you hope so <laughs> hmm? you hope no like i know the thing is that the firstborn girl is like supposed to look like the dad and then the firstborn boy is supposed to look like the mom and then any other kid in between that just like looks like whoever. I think the baby was early or late. I'm guessing early. early. Yeah. I don't think she'll be late. If I went late, like my doctor doesn't let you go late, like they will induce you at 40 weeks. So I think she'll be early either way though, like Allura. I was induced, but I still had her 90s early. I think induced me 90s early. So I feel like I'll just go early either way, though, because I'm, like, 100% convinced that she'll be born in November this month. I just, like, feel it in my bones. How do you feel, too? Um, I think early December. I don't know. Like, the first few days. The first day. Do you think this baby will be very different than Allure was as a newborn and how? I honestly don't know. The only things that was like annoying with Allura was that she never went to sleep really. And like when she did sleep, it was like when I was 100% awake. So like during the nighttime, she never slept. She would literally stare at me unless I was holding her. Yeah. Jason, and then she would wake up in the middle of the night and Brooke would FaceTime me every time. You're more confident in your ability to take care of a newborn than you were with Allura. And Obviously. Is Jason, and is Jason nervous because he was taking care of a newborn basically for the first time? Like, no. nights and stuff. No, I'm not nervous. Why would I be nervous? I'm definitely more confident because I actually know, like, what the heck I'm doing now. And, like, I know way more. Like, I just know, like, more everything about babies in general. And so, I'm, like, not scared at all for that. Like, I definitely am way more confident. And I just, like, know what works and what doesn't. And then, yeah, exactly. with... I don't know how you feel. I don't think it'll be hard. Definitely Same. hard to like adjust that first with Allure because I obviously was like never sleeping and like your body's just like, what the heck is happening? Yeah. After a few days though, you're just like, whatever, this is my life now. <laughs> a few questions. Did you feel like aborting your first child since you got pregnant so young? Do I feel like what? Aborting our first child since we got pregnant so young. No. No. Honestly, that wasn't even like a thought in my head. I was just like, okay, I'm pregnant now. I'm having a baby. Did your show turn off? And I was just like, okay, whatever. I'm having a new kid. And I just had a kid. <laughs> Do you guys feel ready to have your second kid at your age? Mm-hmm. Oh, you already asked no, I didn't. I feel 
like obviously I'm ready because like you kind of have to be ready but I also feel like I don't know <laughs> time you've been pregnant you think you uh, aren't ready what you've been saying you think you're not prepared no I mean like I feel like I didn't have stuff together like I was like I need a car seat I need yeah. that's what I meant I don't feel like I'm like mentally not prepared it's more like yeah. all the little stuff that you need but, but besides that, no, like, I definitely feel like mentally prepared just because we had a Laura. She's like two years and seven months old. Like I've already been a parent and I was going to be, what? But like, even if we didn't have a baby right now, there wasn't going to be like that much in between us like having our second kid. Like a year, year and a half, not like five. Yeah. I wouldn't be like 27 having my second kid. Are you guys gonna send your kids to daycare? No. We literally talked about this yesterday about how expensive daycare is. Like, we never plan on sending them to daycare. We were just talking about the fact that it's like $400 for five days. It doesn't even seem worth it. I just feel like that's literally insane. Yeah. Why won't you tell us the name of your second child? Well. Brother, why can't you guys wait? <laughs> I just didn't want to share it just because. With Alora, we mm. did tell our family and whatever, but then I felt like people who I did not want to know mm. found <laughs> out, and that made me really mad, and I was like, I'm not doing that again, so for my next children I'm having, I'm like, nobody's knowing. <laughs> I just told you what she said. Are you just eating that? <laughs> Part of this pregnancy has been your favorite. Honestly, like nothing. <laughs> I like it when uh, Rick does her flip. <laughs> what flip? I got show my you. handstand. Uh -huh. Sometimes I try to be a gymnast and <laughs> um, like do my handstand. I can't. I can barely get off the floor. You think she's gonna be blonde or brunette? I think brown. I think brown too. Brown hair. Like I just feel it. I don't feel like any of my kids will have blonde hair. Maybe if I had a boy. Let me take your phone. The camera overheated. Is that good? It's done that like two times before. The one time we were in North Carolina, it went overheated. This is Jason's stream video games. No, but I want to. He did one time, and I literally played with him. I want to. I want to play uh, the new Fortnite. Glad, smiley face, you four pregnant, pregnant emoji, without trying, or are you still in shock? Am I glad I got pregnant without trying? Yeah. Um, or are you still in shock? I don't know. I'm not in shock because I already know I've been pregnant. But am I glad I got pregnant without trying? I mean, I guess because like I didn't have to try. I don't know. I don't know how to answer that. Be honest. Did you accidentally have a kid? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Will you try for a fourth baby if your third baby's a girl? If my fourth, if my third is a girl, I'm done. I'm not doing like. <laughs> I need a son, bro. I really think that my last baby will be a boy, but if I don't have a boy last, then whatever. I literally was going to get my nails done today, and they said they had no openings, so I'm still stuck with one fingernail with no nail. Are you going to record the birth of the baby? No. What? What do you, you mean, you no? You want me to record you giving No, birth? we're recording the labor and delivery. We're not going to record like the baby literally coming out of me. It was our little Q&A of answering last minute questions you guys had about, like, us, I guess. The baby. The camera, the camera got overheating because it's like really sunny outside. I told Jason, don't park in the sun. I thought it was out of the sun. It was kind of out of the sun, but like the thing the camera was on was in the sun. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I literally. Although there's nothing in that. There's no water in there.